So this is the indoor pool that we're about to get in. You see Carolina's already in there, she beat me. But, um, gotta take the pictures. So we're gonna get in that and enjoy. Maybe, I don't know. I don't know if I wanna put my phone over here, but I'm gonna take a chance, it's waterproof, but, yeah. Oh my God, it's cold in this pool. <laughs> it's colder than the outdoor pool and this pool. So, oh my God, I just have to get in. Oh, it's so cold. My phone better not fall in this pool. I'm gonna be mad, it's supposed to be waterproof, but I don't trust that. Look at Carolina throwing balls at me. Where's she at? Oh, she went under. Woo, trying to take a picture of us. I'm trying to take a picture of us. Oh my God, it's so So yeah, how big is this pool? This one does, oh, it's three feet. It's six feet in the middle. And it goes all every, the way every around. Every is pretty much a standard length of whatever we were. Which is good, because what if, you know when we used to be in the Bay Area, and we used to go to this place called Hayward Plunge? It was a public pool for everybody, it was, but it was indoor, and it was huge. But it had the 10 feet, and it had the diving board, and everything. I wonder if Hayward Plunge still exists. I gotta ask my brother, because him and his wife live in Hayward. I gotta ask, because I would... I used to go there when I was little so much in the summer because, you know, nobody really had a pool and it just were kind of special. I think we were special, but we didn't have a pool. Um, so, I gotta see, it used to be so much fun. It used to be a lot of people because it was like the public pool. And um, so I gotta see if it still exists. I like to do exercises in the pool. So you can see the jacuzzi from here. Is that you throwing it at me? Yeah. <laughs> I was like, what is she doing? She's throwing balls at me. So this is the pool I used to do when I came here for therapy. I used to do, and then I used to do the thing that she has in her hand. They used to have me hanging off of that thing because it's really good for your back and your knees. It's a, like a, what do you call those? A, who? Noodle? Noodle. They, when I was coming for therapy, they would um, let me hang on it because they said it was really good for your back and your knees. And so I should be doing that because I still suffer from back problems and I definitely have arthritis. So oh, this feels so good. It just feels relaxing just being in the pool just feels relaxing now that i'm in it doesn't feel so cold but um i'm gonna turn you this way it's my shirt oh i gotta forgot to tuck my shirt in because it'll lift up i couldn't find we went to the store and i couldn't find a swimming suit they were like missing the, the top or the bottom or the whole ones they didn't have many hole pieces and they found one, it was like $17. I'm like, uh, no, it wasn't even that pretty. It didn't have a design or it was black, huh? <laughs> yeah. It was like blah. So I didn't get it. So I'm gonna go to Ross when I get a chance and find a swimming suit that I really, really like. That's cute. <laughs> I haven't had it, cause I haven't been swimming in so long. We used to have a swimming pool in our old house. That's the last time that I swam or had a swimming suit, which was three years ago. So I <sighs> don't know what I did with it. It was pink and black, but so definitely got to buy me a new one. And it was time for a new one anyway. Oh, this feels good. Good, 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 good. This is a bit, do you think this pool is bigger than outside or is it about the same size? It's probably the same size. She's swimming. <laughs> wow. Get my wings. Oh my god, my hairs come on. They, I call them wings. I try to lean on this thing and do exercises. Look, with my, for my knees and my legs, my back. It's so pretty over here. Both pools are nice. Like I said, I've been in this one before years ago. 
one um, from my back and stuff back in 2005, between 2005 and 2009, and it's the last time I have been here. And I'm so glad we joined. It's our big health club in our town. Um, we have a lot of other gyms, but all the other gyms, like I said, just offer machines and weights. No pools, no jacuzzis, no saunas, no dance rooms, studio rooms, sports rooms. This one has the, in, the huge indoor pool, huge outdoor pool, the jacuzzi that I showed you, the sauna, racquetball room, basketball room, like three to five weight and machine rooms. Um, uh, three studios for dancing, exercising, aerobics, all that stuff. I can't think of what else it has. Um, but um, where are you at on the whole other side? I can't go. Um, then it has a, has a smoothie bar. It has a lounge where you can sit down and watch TV and lay down like one of those leather sectional couches type of thing. And then it has a, a platform above it. It has like round dining room tables where you can eat at. And then they have a smoothie bar and a snack bar, like healthy snacks, I'm assuming, sandwiches, stuff like that, and a smoothie machine, healthy smoothie bar thing. So it's spot, it's really great. And we were debating only because the other gyms, well, two other gyms, I think Anytime Fitness and World Gym is 24 hours. So a lot of people go there for those reasons, because of their work schedules or school schedules. For example, my boyfriend. Her boyfriend. That's why he goes to one of those because and he don't come here. He works and goes to school at night. And goes to college at night. So look at I'm, I'm sitting on two noodles. Look at her. Uh. Trying to take a picture. I cannot. I'm gonna wet the phone. Oh well. Look at this Look at her. Look at her and her noodles. Oh <laughs> Um. And what else does it have? I think I mentioned everything. So it's really, really cool. We used to live on the north end of town. And this is guy looking at me for We used to live on the north end of town. And this is on the total opposite end of town. It's on the south end of town. And, but now we live on the south end of town. So now we could, we could go. It's really close. It's like between our exit and the next exit. So like, we could walk here if we really wanted to, but driving is just like, what, three minutes to get here? So. Some people in here are probably thinking I'm filming them or taking pictures of them. Uh, no. I mean, they're not saying anything, but they're looking like, what is she doing? Is she FaceTiming? Is she talking to herself? Is she taking pictures? Is she videotaping us? Or what is she videotaping for? And they're not, their looks are not like they're really taking it bad, but they're like curious, like what's going on with her phone? Does she realize that she drops that phone? <laughs> it can damage, even though my phone is waterproof. I have the Galaxy 8. Thank you very much. But um, that's the only thing about YouTubing is that you, you know, when you're YouTubing in public, um, people think you're taking pictures of them or filming them. They don't want to be on video. I'm like, unless you're directly coming after me to video tape me, I, I see that you're suspicious even if it would bother me, but I would just walk away. Um, but if I can tell that you're talking to the camera, why would you be talking to the camera if you have it turned around and, and filming them? I just, I just don't get it. So it's, it gets kind of hard, and I know there's other YouTubers go through that too, where people look at them crazy. I was in Applebee's once, and one couple told the lady that they didn't want me filming them, and she goes, are you 
like videotape and I'm like yes I am and I heard what that lady said I said I am a youtuber and I am filming myself and my daughter I'm like I do not want to film other people that I have nothing to do with why would why would I why, don't flatter yourself I mean why would I want to film you I mean I respect people's privacy like I expect people to respect mine the cameras facing me I said I would not do that you know deliberately I, if I really wanted them in the video for a certain reason a certain cause or something that's really meaningful or important or touching I would say hey can I really thank you for this reason or this cause I just wouldn't go and chase after you videotape you or just to be nosy I'm just, that's not the person that I am but you know it's hard so you just have to like you know, just do what you got to do, do you, and not worry about it. You're not doing anything wrong or deliberately, so you're just trying to videotape your life, your family, things that, are you, that you're doing in your life or fun that you're having, so what does it matter? Look at her, she's floating away, look. I want to say caboodles, I want to call them. Huh? I want to call them caboodles, I don't know why. <laughs> Make up fanatic. <laughs> That's why. Hold on. I'm gonna do some exercising. Whoa. <laughs> I'm kicking, doing some leg exercises and some knee exercises while I'm here. <laughs> Where are you? Oh. I don't even think she can hear me. Well, I'm going to go swim and enjoy. I'll come back. Hopefully, I'll come back and do some more clips of my first day in the health club. If not, thank you so much for watching. Give these videos a thumbs up. If you like them or enjoy them or just want to support your girl, um, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. So, but I am going to try to um, video clip some more. So, be back. <laughs>